Looking to end a five-game losing skid, the Ryerson Rams enter into action against the RMC Paladins in front of several alumni who were on hand to participate in the annual Blue and White game earlier in the day. After taking an early 1-0 lead in the first two minutes, RMC allowed two Ryerson goals from where Corey Konechny. Rams goaltender Paul Gibson airmailed a pass to center ice for Konechny, who dropped to Marcus Booth, who then made a great pass for Brent Small. Small would make no mistake as he outmaneuvers RMC goaltender Andrew Fleming to put the Rams up 3-1. Tempers flare in the second as Rams defender Miles Barbary took offense to a shove from RMC winger Richard Lynn and took matters into his own hands with this vicious slash. RMC would take advantage of the ensuing power play, putting up two goals on the double minors, tying the game at three apiece. The Rams didn't get down and pressed the attack on the Paladins. Moments after an impressive glove save on Troy Murray, Fleming would be caught out of position when he committed too early on the two-on-one, allowing for an easy one-time goal by Small, his second of the afternoon. Konechny scored his third goal of the game on this great setup by rookie Matt Schmermond, restoring the Rams' two-goal lead. A frustrated RMC team upped the physical play in the third period, and the Rams were quick to respond with several big hits of their own. The teams began a continuous parade to the sin bin for the remainder of the contest. Fleming misplays the puck, but is able to get back in time to make the initial save. However, the rebound goes to Alexei Dostinov, who finds a wide open Schmerman who is there to tap it in to put the Rams up 6-3. Ryerson would go on to win the game 8-3. Small and Konechny netted a hat-trick each, while Konechny, Sherman, and Dostinov recorded six points each. The Rams will host the Nipissing Lakers on Thursday night at George Bell Arena. Ryerson is in sixth place in the Eastern Conference, two points up on the Lakers. The two teams will meet three times in the next three weeks. It's a relief for everybody. Uh, I felt when we were down 5-2 against U of T that players dug in and we had a heck of a third and battled back and tied it. And getting that one point psychologically, even though we lost in the shootout, um, kind of turned around our four-game losing streak. And then we knew uh, with Concordia winning last night, and we knew uh, U of T beating RMC that we were have to be on top of our game today, and we needed two points, or else it was going to be a race for the playoffs. So not that... Um, it gives us a little bit of breathing loom, but we still have to play good, solid hockey. For the Ryerson Rams Network, I'm Scott Alexander.